Hi, my name is Janet Wallace. Working on this series was very important because um, it really took a lot of my feelings and uh, I was able to channel it through my artwork. Just really putting forth what I believe in. This is one of the uh, images I did for the Women's March. thought, well, maybe I will do a series of artwork that builds on this. So what I did was I took a lot of work that I'd previously done, smaller pieces, and I, you know, I'm an avid reader, particularly I always read the newspaper, so a lot of the articles after the election I cut out from the paper and I stretched a lot of canvas and I put articles on the canvas. In some cases I put tweets and then I documented the process of painting over. So I took Trump's tweets, put it on the canvas and then I'd paint over with something that I felt was more life affirming and really in most cases stemmed from pieces I did decades ago but smaller. So the final outcome were uh, you know, if it was newspaper, you would see some coming through. And uh, with the tweets, I covered the tweets over. I really didn't want to l read them uh, continually, but I documented it so that it's recorded as part of the, of, of the piece. Many people will recognize this iconic, it's from an iconic photo from the 30s of a bread line and which ironically had billboards behind that's a world's high standard of living and there's no way like the American way. So I did the painting and then I added this quote from Plutarch, an imbalance between rich and poor is the oldest and most fatal ailment of all republics and Plutarch lived almost 2,000 years ago, so he was on to something that still needs serious adjusting. Really, that's what I feel. It's like covering the negative news and the, you know, all the hype that we get into and trying to change the dialogue a little bit and put something more, uh, not just positive, but these are actual tangible things that we need to work towards. up there beyond the sky it's been a long a long time coming but I know a change gonna come oh yes it will I go to the movie and I go downtown Somebody keep telling me don't hang around. It's been a long, a long time coming, but I know a change gonna come. Oh, yes, it will. Then I go to my brother. Say, brother, help me, please. But he winds up 
knocking me back down on my knees. Oh, there have been times that I thought I could last for long, but now I think I'm able to carry on. It's been a But I know change gonna come.